Hey, how's it going? We're playing slide three. Let's go ahead and grab our boy Bentley and head over to a mission. We still have a couple of bottles and a couple of treasures to still do, but we'll do them as we go. Um, I don't. I think we're probably like three fourths the way through this level, maybe maybe half. So we still got quite a bit of time to look around while we're at it. And I don't think we've actually pulled out Bentley for a mission yet here. Let's go ahead and do the sleep darts, huh? Bob, you going to sleep. Good night. Why don't I just leave this next to you, huh? Bop. Hmm. I did. Check. Dart ammo check. Tire pressure check. Bentley. How many equipment checks are you going to do? Just being prepared, Sly. A field operative can never be too careful. Or watch too many spy movies, apparently. They're good reference. Those ice caves are a textbook example of a villain's hidden operation. Relax, pal. It's simple. Use the thermovision to find Grizz, tag him with the homing dart, and let him lead us to his lair. Avoiding any lethal obstacles or bloodthirsty guards along the way, of course. Right. Simple. I'll see you back at the hideout. Let's go, Bentley. Ugh. Get about there. Ooh. Ooh. That end? I think not. Time to use the thermo vision. Okay, those are things I can blow up. It looks like he's walking more towards that other one. How about you go to sleep, huh? Bop. You go to sleep too. Dude, I'm an absolute unit with that. You got a little shmoney on you. You give me what you got. You got some cheese on you? A little cheese eating rat? So it's cheese. 100 bucks. Oh, I missed one. He probably went over here. Oh, okay. Yeet. Alright, that makes more sense. I just missed one. Grizz came this way. The thermo vision should detect his footprints. <gasps> oh, I almost didn't make it. Yep, he went this way. Obviously. The Grizz. Oh, yeah. They say I'm like the Vinci, master with a brush. When my art is on the wall, it makes the crowd hush. There he is. Tag him, Bentley. Hold on, Sly. There's something funny about that painting. What happened, Bentley? He was right there. I'm sorry, Sly. It's just this artwork. Just as I suspected, the statue and these paintings have a few things in common. And what is that, Bentley? <gasps> Do I gotta hit him? What do I do? Hit him? That's not it. Try again. Oh, okay. Apple. That's the one. Yep. They look like switches. I bet I could activate them with my dart gun. And the penguin, right? Which one's the penguin? Is that a bird or a penguin? Hit it. Am I blind? I literally hit that one before. Go, pal. Now, go find that bear. I love that. When I hit the right thing and the game's just like, no. <laughs> no, probably not. Okay. This must be how Grizz moves the eggs back to his mountain base. Nope, that's not what I wanted to do. Apparently that is what I needed to do. All right, I don't understand this game sometimes. Bruh. I need to make it to. It's like Indiana Jones. I was close. Let me in. A 
Right, peep this. We are on high alert. Nobody goes in or out but the grid. I gotta go finish your painting, you dig? Good. Now take these and keep your eyes <laughs> What are these stones? Is that jewels? Like that door is missing something. Yeah, a makeover. No, Sly. I'm sure the gems Grizz gave the guards unlocked the door. I'll just have to get them the old-fashioned way. By asking politely? Funny. No, by picking some pockets. I can't tell which guards have them, though. Hmm. There's another way. How about using thermovision? I think you're right. Wow, this is a first. Okay. Now who's being funny? I better use the thermovision to see which guards have the gems. Hello? Do I have to do I have to put him to sleep? Is that the, the the thing? I don't understand. That was very, very close. Unless he doesn't have it anymore. Oh, he does have it. Alright, I'm putting you to sleep. Okay, apparently I have to put him to sleep because. Because I don't know. Gallery gem door. Now question, can I bomb him? Without Okay, didn't even kill him. Okay, noted. Alright, this guy's gotta go to sleep. Night night. Bentley, you absolute buffoon. Start taking his things! I don't understand. Why aren't you taking his things? Go back to sleep. There we go. Alright, one more. That guy right there. <gasps> I almost got caught. Wanna go to sleep? You wanna say night night? Night night. There we go. The jewels. Shake this tail, Grizz. Uh, did you just say something about shaking your tail? Quiet, Sly. I've got a bear to catch. I don't think Bentley has a tail, does he? I think turtles have tails, right? The way I'm going out is egg salad. No. <laughs> but why was. Wouldn't turtle soup make more sense? Turtle soup would make more sense here, but. It's okay, Bentley. You're not. <laughs> He's not super comedic anyway. Eat. Please go down. Please hey, go down. Serving it up. Ugh, Gary's way. Pop. Oh, I need to go here. Let me in. The quiz got to put some art on ice. Going to dig it up later for a big fat price. The paradox is a stinking dude. And I'm getting real sick of his attitude. It looks like Grizz is planting fake cave paintings. He's working a prehistoric art scam. I get it. Them here, then goes back to the present, digs them up, and sells them for a fortune. What a con! Hurry up and tag him before he gets away again. Right, just to be safe, I'm going to use multiple darts. Three should do the trick. Belly, you need to make sure those darts stick to him. Aim for that rip in his pants. Time to put the dart gun to business. Here we go. Stand still, bud. Time for your vaccines. So what is he just like? I can't shoot through all this ice. You need to move. Also, they called him a con. It's not a con. They are prehistoric. Okay, that was not a bullseye, but I'm glad they took it. Thank you, game. I I'm getting squirted on, bro. Don't have much time. 
Uh, Very nice. Yeah, I shot the guy thrice. Sorry, the rhyming is contagious. One of these days he's gonna get served. Yeah, the Grizz is gonna crush that little nerd. I feel like the second he sits down, that's gonna hurt a lot more. So, not the best place. They should have made that uh, rip in his. They put a rip in his shirt. Because, this again, the second he sits down, he's gonna know they're there now. So, that's kind of wasted. But, hey, that's just me. Alright, let's grab Sly back out. Yeah, again, is that really con though? Because technically they are prehistoric. He's not lying. It doesn't matter who made them. They are still whatever amount of years old. So technically they're still worth something. It's it's not his fault that he figured out a way to time travel. As far as I'm concerned, those are still worth quite a bit. You know, even if he's the one that made them, they're still old. Now, I guess if everybody had that ability, then all of a sudden they would become worthless but doesn't seem like many people have this ability so if it's just him you know unless you know if he makes a couple thousand copies and yeah all of a sudden it becomes or not worth a lot but if it's just a couple of paintings technically in my opinion that's fair game We probably didn't even need the darts. He's kind of hard to miss. Okay, he's on the move, Sly. Stay close so I can pull the data we need off his phone. And don't underestimate him. He's no lightweight. No, it looks kind of chunky. I still think, and I'm going to keep this opinion. My name is the Grizz. You see, I'm hairy and scary and all of that stuff. Get the heck out of my way. Oh, I'm going to get rid Okay, apparently I can't hit anyone. I still think he's just basically a Walmart uh, Dimitri. My name is the Grizz. You see, I'm hairy and scary and all of that stuff. Get the heck out of my way. Oh, I'm going to get rough. What? Zoink? Like, he's just the opposite of Dimitri. He's, you know, he's fat. He's a different animal, but he's still got that hip hop thing. His whole thing is about art and hip hop music. He's literally Dimitri. Really couldn't, up, couldn't have come up with a little bit more of an original character for him. Hey, that's just me. What? Bro, you trying to run some kind of game on the Grizz? I'm tired of you telling me to walk the line straight when you walking it all crooked. Yeah, that's right. Uh-uh, uh-uh, no, no, no. That ain't the deal we had. Nuh-uh, no. I got you the cane that that big old hairy dude made. Now you need to hook me up. Hook me up. Yeah. Hold on. I said I'm losing signal. I said I... Hold on. I can't... Hold on. You catch that, Bentley? Yeah, sounds like he's talking to La Paradox. And there's trouble. Don't lose him. Well, losing him wasn't part of my plan. Live large with a brush. Don't step on my canvas, cause you'll just get crushed. He's kind of bad at this. Bim boom 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 boom. Don't need no canvas. I just paint on the wall. Nobody give me static, cause I'm better than y'all. Hmm, okay, where am I gonna hide? You there? Good. Now listen up. The eggs are running out here, but I need to keep my paint production going, so I need you to find me the resources. What? Well, I don't know. You know, like, uh, chickens, turkey, ostriches, parrot, frog. How would I know? Just make it happen, man. Put out, oh, man. Hold on, I, I gotta find some reception. I gotta find some. Hold up, man. Stop. Oh, hold on. Bentley, why don't we have a phone like that to talk to Dimitri? Do you really want Dimitri calling you? Good point. Forget I asked. 
All right, we're going to continue following him. Yeah, who is he on the phone with, and how is he talking interdimensionally? Oh, well, I'm glad he never looks back. I know in the prior games, whenever we had following missions, they would always be like, ho, ho, and they would like look back. My bro over here is not bothering in the slightest. He's just walking. Okay, I need to... Crying over here. Bentley's got the jokes. All right. Also, if you guys didn't know. Why are you farting like that? some beans before he got here All right, how in the world am I supposed to get past these two so I'm rolling. I'm maybe I don't love that oh he, he he running running now where are you going homeboy stop tooting Finding this all pretty entertaining. Yeah, it gives us an advantage and put us off the gate. Bro, stop running. Don't fart either. Yo, that dude came out of nowhere. Fart. If you fart, I'm gonna. Mm, I'm gonna smell it. I'm gonna sniff it. Yellow freak. No farting. Now let me tell you how it is. I am an artist. I got paintings to create. And I ain't putting up with any more of your excuses. Now, you get me the eggs I need for my paint, or I climb through this phone and squeeze them out of you myself. You got that player? Hello? Hello? Why you did that? Damn. So he's using the eggs for paint? Oh, I was so close. I guess that means you didn't get the code. It does. Looks like we're back to square one. I guess the bear got away, huh? Carmelita, it's good to see you. Uh-huh. I'm only talking to you because I have some information for Bentley. I've been tailing Grizz on my own, and I have the security codes and full schematics for his mountain base. Wow. Thanks. You're welcome. So you'll get it to Bentley for me? Of course. I'm headed back to the hideout now. But wouldn't you rather hand it to him yourself? Maybe I should. After all, you're not exactly trustworthy, are you? Ouch. So, we're good, right? Don't push your luck, Ringtail. Got done, though. Look at us go. 
All right, we still got, I think, three more treasure or bottles to find. I'm a little scared we're getting near the end of the level here, and I'm not finding them. I caught up with the ringtail to give him the intel I'd gathered on Grizz. Half of me still wanted to slap the smirk off his face, but the other half wanted to talk. Working on my own these past few days had given me time to think, and I'd realized some things. Sly may have been lying to me the whole time in Paris, but I'd lied to myself as well. In my heart, I knew something was up, but I didn't want to admit it. I wanted to believe he'd changed, that maybe I'd changed him. But Sly was who he was, and I had to accept that. Although this crazy time-traveling business had given me a new perspective on that, too. In the past, I'd always chased Sly, arriving on the scene after the fact. But now that I'd fought alongside him, with Bentley, Murray, and his ancestors, I had to admit a newfound respect. We aren't really so different. We both fight for justice. We just do it from opposite sides of the law. The question is, can I live with that? Honestly, I don't know. But for now, perhaps it's enough that I see things more clearly, and that we have a common enemy in the paradox. Because I am not going anywhere until I put that stinking weasel behind bars. Very cool, Carmelita. Very cool. Okay. Mm. Oh, we can actually go out and play with Carmelita. That's pretty cool. Thief net time. Let's see. Can we get anything? Oh, actually, we can get basically everything. Oh. All right. Oh. All right. So we got this, this. So is that three more? Okay, we got three more things. Oh, no. We got a lot of things to buy. Holy. Okay. I miss. I, miss, I uh, underestimated. How many moves we've unlocked with uh, these past couple missions. Okay, noted. I have to try a little harder to get these treasures. We only got 26%, so I've very clearly missed a whole lot of them. L2, what did I purchase? I don't think I purchased anything new. Is mine? We still haven't found another tier 3 ever since we found the first one. Hmm... There's a collectible. Don't tell me I need to come. Am I not able to get it without Shooty Boy? There's a collectible, though. Hmm. Okay, I think this is the way up. Right. There is... That one. Two more. Here we go. Two more. Ooh, there's a treasure right there. Could definitely go for that treasure right now. Whoops. To smack him up. All right, let's take this treasure back home at least. Alright, let's go ahead and uh, give this treasure another whirl here. Maybe not screw it up this time. That would be pretty cool. Yeet. There we go. Just had to pull out my glider just a little bit later there. And with that, gives us more than enough time to return it back to the base. Stone wheel. Okay, there we go. Okay. After this, we'll just need one more. I knew there was going to be one around here somewhere. Ah. Uh, Alright. One more. One more. Let's see if we can find it. There is a piece of treasure. You don't got to tell me twice about treasure. Ah! Yep, there we go. Okay, where's the hideout right there? Shouldn't be too bad. Okay. Not really? 
Please, 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 please. Oh, we hit that. With, like, no time to spare. Holy, okay. Alright, one more. I have an inkling that thing is going to be around here somewhere. <gasps> there you are, bud. Alright, now we gotta go find the safe. Well, find, I mean, we gotta go to the safe. I know where the safe's at. It is hidden. I actually think we're technically going the wrong way. We're supposed to head the other direction. Yes, maybe not. Yeah, right here. It is in here. Let's go ahead and do it. Oop, I forgot that this is, this is on a time. Come on, come on, game. Just work with me here. Work with me. All right. Yeah, they always give us a little too much time for these. They're not very hard to do. Clockwork eye. What in the world does that do? I'm guessing that's gonna like probably point us in the direction of treasure or something along those lines. Hmm. Anyway, guys, we're gonna end off the episode here. Thanks for watching.